I am Yaya Amari. I'm currently a researcher in the field of renewable energies. I present my project by which I participate in the MIT Arab competition. My project is very simple and very complicated at the same time. The problem I, uh, that I'm trying to resolve is that the transition to the use of clean energy is necessary but renewable energies as they are today do not represent a real solution for our real problems so it is necessary to find other solutions and other sources oh. after seven years of research in the field of renewable energies i am here to tell you that i have arrived to prove that matter any matter that you see around you contains an infinite amount of energy to explain that, it's very simple. If anyone asks you to lift a weight and keep it in a fixed position like that, you can do it, but not for more than a few minutes. Of course, after a few minutes, you will not be able to do that anymore, because you will not have enough energy to this. But if you hang it on a hook like that, this one can stand it not only for a few minutes but for years. No, the hook is not stable. No, the hook is not stable. The hook is vibrating all the time. It is the vibration of the atoms. As long as there is temperature, there is vibration even if we do not see it. A temperature is a vibration. As long as there is a temperature, there is a vibration even if we do not see it. It is the energy that keeps solid which is solid, despite the permanent vibration. At a temperature of 25 degrees Celsius, the energy provided to keep Burj Khalifa in his position and shape for one second is more than 343 billion joules. At a temperature of 25 degrees Celsius, the energy provided to keep Eiffel Tower in its position and shape for one second is more than than 6.9 billion joules. I have been working on this topic for many years. I have sent the results of my analysis to more than 240 researchers around the world. I received no scientific objection. My project is to extract that magnetic energy as you can see in the explanation and transform it into useful forms of energy. Thank you to all of you.